What's up, tech lovers? Today we're diving deep into the world of foldable phones with Samsung's latest powerhouses, the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and the Galaxy Z Flip 6. These aren't just phones, they're engineering marvels that promise to be tougher, more resilient, and ready to handle anything you throw at them. Let's break it down. Samsung has always been at the forefront of foldable phone technology, and these new models are no exception. They've taken durability to a whole new level. Let's talk about what makes these phones so tough. First up, the dual rail hinge. This is the backbone of these foldable phones, and Samsung has beefed it up. The folding edge is now stronger, better at distributing shock, and less likely to crack under pressure. That means fewer worries about accidental drops. Next, the Armor Aluminum Frame. Not only does it look sleek, but it's also 10% more scratch resistant than before. Say goodbye to those annoying little scratches that ruin the look of your phone. And let's not forget the stars of the show, the displays. Samsung has added an extra layer of protection to these foldable screens, making them more resistant to shocks and less prone to that pesky crease. It's a smooth and more durable experience overall. Now let's talk water and dust resistance. Both the Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 have the same water resistance as their predecessors, but Samsung has made a huge leap in dust protection. They've gone from an IPX8 rating to an IP48 rating. What does that mean? Well, it means these phones are now resistant to solid objects larger than one millimeter. That's a game changer. We've all heard horror stories about dust and debris getting into the hinge and causing problems. With this new IP rating, Samsung is taking a big step towards preventing that. And let's not forget about the sweeper mechanism. It's like the phone's little bodyguard working hard to keep dust and dirt out. While Samsung has already made improvements to it, this new IP rating is an extra layer of protection. So what does all this mean for you? It means you can enjoy your foldable phone without constantly worrying about breaking it. Whether you're at the beach, hiking, or just living your life, the Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6 are built to keep up. Samsung has truly raised the bar with the Galaxy Z Fold 6 and Z Flip 6, these phones are not only stylish and powerful, but also incredibly tough. If you're in the market for a foldable phone that can handle anything you throw at it, these are definitely worth considering. That's all for now, tech lovers. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more awesome tech content. And let us know in the comments below what you think of these new foldable phones. Are you excited about the durability improvements? We can't wait to hear from you. Today, we are diving into the latest buzz surrounding the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. Buckle up, because this phone is shaping up to be a true game changer in the world of smartphones. Let's get into the juicy details. First off, Samsung seems laser focused on making the S25 Ultra the king of smartphones in 2025. The company appears to be using a two-pronged attack to achieve this, a monstrous camera system and mind-blowing performance upgrades. Let's start with the camera. The Galaxy S25 Ultra is expected to stick with its familiar quad camera setup, but with some serious enhancements. The main sensor will likely boast a hopping 200 megapixels, matching the S24 Ultra but optimized for the S25 Ultra's specific hardware thanks to the new Snapdragon Agent 4 camera ISP. But that's not all. We're also looking at a 5x optical zoom lens with a 50 megapixel sensor, a brand new 3x optical zoom lens, also with a 50 megapixel sensor, and an ultra wide angle lens getting a bump to 50 megapixels as well. These upgrades, particularly for the 3X zoom and ultra-wide sensors, are long overdue and promise to significantly elevate mobile photography. Now let's talk about performance. One of the most exciting rumors is the reintroduction of a fan-favorite feature, a 16GB RAM option. And not just any RAM, but the industry-first LPDDR5X RAM, capable of speeds up to a staggering 10.7 GEPs. This translates to unparalleled performance for on-device AI, demanding tasks like cloud gaming, and much more. When you combine this insane RAM with the power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 processor, the S25 Ultra has the potential to be the absolute performance leader in the smartphone world. Speaking of the Agent 4, another reliable leak suggests it'll house the most powerful GPU ever seen in a smartphone. Benchmarks show prototypes running Genshin Impact at a smooth 1080 resolution and 60 FPS. A dream for mobile gamers. Currently, this popular game is capped at 720 on most phones and maintaining a consistent 60 FPS is a struggle. Of course, with great power comes a potentially higher price tag. Rumors suggest this Snapdragon Agent 4 chip could inflate the price of the entire S25 series compared to its predecessor. Qualcomm has reportedly increased the cost of the Agent 4 significantly compared to the Agent 3. This leaves Samsung with a tough choice raise prices across the board, or potentially use the Exynos 2500 processor for the S25 and S25 Plus, 
reserving the mighty Agent 4 exclusively for the S25 Ultra. The Agent 4 itself is a whole new beast, built from the ground up using Qualcomm's Super Orion cores previously seen in their laptops. This chip has the potential to give the Galaxy S25 Ultra performance that rivals some Apple M-series laptops. But wait, there's more. We also have hot rumors about the Galaxy S25 Ultra being equipped with the next generation of storage, UFS 4.1. Universal Flash Storage, or UFS, determines how fast your phone can access and store data. The latest and greatest version is UFS 4.0, which powers many current flagships, including the Galaxy S24. But the future is calling and whispers suggest the Galaxy S25 Ultra might be the first to sport UFS 4.1. While UFS 5.0 is expected around 2027, UFS 4.1 steps in as a minor yet significant upgrade. It's not a mind-blowing jump in raw numbers, but it's targeted to enhance specific areas like on-device AI features. Faster read and write speeds with UFS 4.1 will allow the phone to access data needed by AI algorithms much quicker translating to smoother performance for features like scene optimization in your camera app, real-time language translation, and other background AI functions. So, what does this all mean? The Galaxy S25 Ultra, if equipped with UFS 4.1, is shaping up to be a powerhouse for AI enthusiasts. Faster data access, improved multitasking, and potential battery life improvements. That's a recipe for a future-proof phone ready to tackle demanding tasks. Of course, this is all based on rumors for now, but one thing's for sure, the future of smartphones looks increasingly intertwined with the power of AI, and the Galaxy S25 Ultra, with its potential UFS 4.1 upgrade, might just be at the forefront of that exciting evolution. So there you have it! What are your thoughts on the upcoming S25 Ultra? Are the camera upgrades exciting you? Can't wait for the return of 16GB RAM? Or is the potential power of the Snapdragon Agent 4 blowing your mind? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in! I will see you in the next one, guys. Until then, goodbye.